it's Patrick here and uh, today I'm going to talk about um, possible connections uh, from your computer to your DAC or uh, digital to analog um, converter. There are basically three options. You can stream your music with the Bluetooth if you do have uh, uh, this Bluetooth dongle. Uh, it's pretty useful during the day when you don't want to connect your computer um, to your DAC and, and have it close to your uh, hi-fi equipment because it's of course uh, otherwise you have to use the cables and um, if you use the Bluetooth I you know I usually do, do it during the day because then I sit on my sofa and uh, just relax play music and do some other stuff on the computer um, uh, but if you really want to have a good quality then you have to um, connect your uh, computer with either a USB cable um, which is probably the best solution and there's there's another option here uh, I have this um, um, optical cable uh, which has this special port um, I don't know um, have you noticed but uh, but um, if you use this mini jack um, at the end of it there's a uh, there's an option for a, an optical uh, connection in your Mac. So basically you need this uh, special um, yeah, tip and then you can uh, plug it in your audio jack and then you will notice um, um, you have to go to your system preferences and then here you will notice that instead of your um, headphones it will say um, optical digital outport um, so I can maybe uh, play you some music and then you will notice what's the difference but uh, with the Bluetooth you will notice that it's much lower a uh, volume of the sound and the quality is, uh, is much worse but uh, let's try if um, if we can hear some difference so now it is um, streaming with the Bluetooth and um, as you can see there's no lights for sampling rate that's because my 44.1 light doesn't work so uh, I believe it's now at this sampling rate and uh, we'll put the volume a little higher Our speakers connected now. I'll be gone before the day. There's still love here. The first love is. And let's see what happens if we switch the connections. So you basically go to your system preferences, and here in. Um, in the sound you can choose your connection out your output and then I'm going to choose the USB now and uh, we're gonna switch the source for this USB you have this 192 light on it's not enough it's not enough it's not enough you can hear it's the sound enough. quality it's not enough it's much better it's not enough it's not enough it's not enough it's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. And I haven't even touched the it's volume now. It's not enough. It's uh, for me. The darkness of the basement. My parents' basement where we used to love. We're so quiet. And we can. We can see what's the difference with this um, optical cable now connected to your mini jack. And um, lungs, you're like so that's fire. pretty good too. You can hear. You're like fire on my tongue. It's not enough. 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 It's not enough, it's not enough, it's not enough, 
It's not enough. 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 It's not enough for me. Switch to Bluetooth once again. See, obviously, this uh, Bluetooth is not enough. Let's hear it with the USB once. So that was a little comparison of the uh, and uh, connection possibilities on your DAC. Um, let me know if you have any comments. And um, yeah, thanks for now. It's not enough. It's not enough.